Wednesday saw the first Millennium Estoril Open night session of the week get underway and it was time for Portuguese fans to get another taste of tennis Francis Tiafo style when he took on 2017 runner-up Gilles Muller in more second round action. After saving three match points en route to victory over Tennis Sangren in the opening round, the next-gen star made a quick start and it wasn't long before he was producing some magical touches on the red clay. He took the opening set 6-4 before Muller, the world number 28, broke early in the second. That advantage didn't last long for the Luxembourg left-hander, though, as TFO turned up the heat. The 20-year-old American broke again late in the set and served it out in style 6-4-7-5 to move into his first ATP clay court quarter-final. Another significant milestone for the youngster. I've had a couple this year on the tour level. I've, I've been really good in the challenger level and you know happy to happy to start winning at this level. Uh, you know, better crowds, you know, better, better hospitality, more money. So uh, it's good. It, I'm uh, having fun. So. In the last match of the day, Argentine Federico Del Bonis was looking to back up his fine first round winner for Albert Ramos Vinales when he took on Italian qualifier Simone Bolelli. It was Del Bonis who jumped into an early advantage when he took the opener 6-3, but back came Bolelli to edge the second 7-5. The Italian world number 153 went from strength to strength in the decider before completing a late night 3-6, 7-5, 6-2 win to move into his first ATP quarterfinal since 2015. He'll be back to take on Francis Tiafoe on Friday.